Hello my beautiful wildflowers, how are you today? Alex is here with Oat Modesty. Well, here I am. And I know I haven't been uploading a whole lot, but I've been busy, I know you guys know that. And I thank you from the bottom of my left ventricles for your patience, okay? But today though, I do have an unboxing and it's Beauty Fix. And as you guys know, this box is from the Durham store. And I do enjoy this box, but it's kind of weird because it's really long and very, very light. So I'm kind of curious as to what's in here today, because they do give you one full size item and I'm thinking whatever it is, it's not very heavy. So yeah, if you're interested in seeing what I received, please stay tuned. <laughs> my beautiful wildflowers I have missed you guys and it feels really good to be behind the camera again and you know when I'm behind the camera I don't think of it as being behind the camera but I'm actually speaking to you and um, I do miss you guys and I miss uploading and all of that but you know um, yeah hopefully I'll be able to do more and but I am still enjoying my job <laughs> update and uh, I did record Mass Monday uh, ladies a little earlier and so I did pick the winner and that should be revealed to you on Monday, okay? And I do continue with the uh, tradition of mask giveaway, weekly mask giveaway. Yeah, that's it. Anyway, so let's keep with the tradition and do a little bit of motivation. And you know, I used to call it affirmation because affirmation is an I statement, but I want you guys to know that you can turn anything into an I statement. So when I tell you whatever the motivation is for the day, make it an I, internalize it if it speaks to you, okay? And today, um, oh, and I wanted to share with you, I got this nifty old phone holder and I just really love it because it's you know it, it's actually I got it from Amazon for like 10 or 12 dollars it's like this and it can adjust and everything I actually bought two for my office and yeah and it spins and all of that stuff and it's so much easier because I used to miss texts and things because I'm so focused on something but now that's like right under my screen and I can just when it pops up I can see it so anyway yeah a little bit of commercial uh, break there okay let's get my app and uh motivation or are you or are you okay here we go and here we go oh and i meant to show what the app looks like in the mass monday video so i'll go ahead and show you if i remember okay but what it looks like is it's a black square with like a quote mark and it says motivation because somebody asked me what app i use okay and so here we go let's go okay here's a black and white one and i hope it's in focus and of course, I haven't read it yet, so I don't know what I'm showing you here. It says, to be the best version of yourself, you must shed the older version that never wants you to change. Ooh, that's a good one. To be the best version of yourself, you must shed the older version that never wants you to change. Wow. You know what? That is so true because for a while there... I really wanted to hold on to my old self. I really wanted to stay true to myself. And then I realized that I can still stay true to myself, my core values, which should not change, and but change my attitude towards life, change my attitude towards everything that I see that's negative, and really spin it to a positive. One of the things that I really struggled with, as you guys know, that when I removed my headscarf, right, my hijab. I mean, I really struggled with that, guys. I mean, that was a part of me, and that became like my sole personality, my sole belief, and that wasn't what it's designed to do, okay? And what it's designed to do is to really preserve your modesty by not showing your hair and covering your neck and doing all those things. But I said to myself, you know, I'm struggling here because of the e external, you know, I don't want to say influences because it's not an influence. It's actually an assault, external assaults that came towards me because of it. But I don't have to change my core values. I don't have to change my modesty. Just because you can see my hair now and you might see my neck or whatever, it still doesn't speak to who I am truly. And if people know me for who I am truly, 
then, you know, they either love me or they hate me. It, it is what it is. I'm a very just person who believes in justice, and some people don't like that. They want to be able to, you know, play around in, in the gray area there, but I'm not like that. And, but that's okay because that's who I am at my core. That cloth on my head did not make me that way. It didn't. And so I said to myself, to be the best version of myself, I have to shed the older version that does not matter. That part that really holds on to my progress and that doesn't allow me to go forward. And so I had to make that decision. It was a very difficult decision and I did not make it alone. I made it with, you know, talking to my husband, getting his input, what he thought, my friend, you know, and everything else. So at the end of it all, it's not going to change who I am. It's actually going to make me stronger on my faith and of my values because when I see that other people who are treated unfairly because of those things, I'm going to stand up for them. And I, you know what? And they're not going to see another person with a headscarf standing up for them, but somebody else that, you know, they don't know that, you know, a Muslim. So sometimes that's all the difference that it needs to make, right? And so, but my values are not going to change. I still, if I'm going to wake up in the morning and say my positive thing, I'm going to have a great day and I'm going to give my 100% to, you know, the members of the hospital, to the staff, the physicians. What I mean by members is patients, by the way. And so really, you know, I'm going to give it 100%. It's not going to change who I am. And so, yeah, sometimes you have to shed your old self. So that way it's not holding you back, uh, allowing your true self to really surface. Okay? So that's that. Anyway, so today I have my beauty fix. And as you guys know, I really love this box. It's $24.95 a month. It's majority of the time it is skincare. And if you like skincare, you like this box maybe. Um, but um, what I like about it is that it has really nice skincare and things that are sold by the derm store and a derm store um, is a very nice store and they do sell um, you know items that are uh, well-known brands um, they have clean beauty if you like clean beauty they have traditional beauty whatever so yeah let's just go ahead and jump into the box but I'm really curious as to what's in here oh by the way I still have this I remember this right guys that go back way back with me know the, uh, the story about this so anyway um, I digress. So anyhow, okay, get that off and let's shut that. Um, anyway, this is um, a beauty box that I really do enjoy. And you guys know I canceled a lot of boxes and majority of my boxes that was not adding value. And I decided in my life, I am only going to keep things that add value. And so this one actually adds value. It might not seem like much, but let's see. Okay, the box looks like this. And it says we're here for the unbashed love of skin. So that right there tells you, Beauty Fix by Derm Store, that it is a skin box. And right away I can see that there is a mask. Oh, the only thing I don't like about this black spaghetti they use is that they actually leave a residue and it sometimes it gets on my clothes. Yeah, it's no likey, me no likey. Anyway, so the first one is by Verso, Deep Hydration Mask. Wow, this feels very... You know what? I wonder if it's old jelly. Oh, I wish I wouldn't have done my mask yet because this I'm curious now. Let's see what it says about it. Okay, it's a moisturizing hydrogel facial mask delivering deep hydration with prolonged effects. So the whole mask is hydrogel, which is different, right? I mean, definitely you see the one under the eyes and around the small lines, but yeah. It says, um, let's see. Contains patented artificial moisturizing factor, AMF, that supports the skin's ability to retain moisture for immediate and long-lasting hydration. It is ideally used once or twice weekly, applied directly on clean skin, remove the thin protective film and place the mask. Then remove the thicker film on top of the mask and leave on for 20 minutes. Avoid contact with eyes should this occur, rinse immediately with water. Okay, we know that. And let's see, and I do not see fragrance, guys. I'm happy. But it does contain, by the looks of this, it's got grapefruit extract. Uh, let's see, things that, you know, there's a lot of scientific things that blah, 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 blah. So I'm not going to read that. Um, let's see, carrageenan extract. And th that comes from carrots, right? Yeah. And then it has um, sodium hyaluronate 
and that's hyaluronic acid. Oh, it's got some good stuff. So yeah, that is that. And I'm gonna enjoy using it. So, okay, that's so far so good. And they did also include two um, samples. And what are these? Um, these are uh, hyaluronic acid intensifier. It's by SkinCeutical and here it is. And yeah, you know, hyaluronic acid is primarily used for your moisture barrier and allows you to retain moisture in your skin, okay? And a lot of people, you know, I have somebody say, well, I have oily skin, okay. There's a difference between oils and moisture. And what you, you know, you still, oily skin still needs moisture. And so don't, you know, don't not use products that retain moisture barrier because you have oily skin because you're doing yourself a disservice. And so those are two different um, issues, right? You have oily skin, okay, you cleanse and you put on products that is made for oily skin but you still should preserve your moisture barrier. And um, hyaluronic acid is one of the best ways to do it because it is, you know, non-comedogenic. It doesn't uh, um, <laughs> clog your pores and all of that. So yeah, and that's that. And next we have by Kate Somerville, and I like her stuff. And this one is a firming serum. Here it is. And this looks like a sample size. Let's see what this looks like. I'm gonna break it. I don't want to break it because you know what? If I don't keep it, I want to be able to give it away. And oh, this is so cute. And it is a firming serum. And it's by Kate Suticles is what she's calling her company. And it's it use AM and PM, apply a thin, even layer to clean, dry face and neck. Okay, that's not bad. It's kind of cute. Look at it. I'm sure this is not a full size, but I mean, enough to try. I mean, it's nice pump. And I like it when it comes like this, not in an open jar because it doesn't allow oxygen to get in and cause oxidation, right? So anyway, yeah, by the way, I'm not wearing a whole, <laughs> I, since I wear makeup to work every day of the week, I try not to wear makeup on a weekend. So what I did today was I put on my eyebrows, mascara, and a little bit of concealer and a, a balm, lip balm, yeah, balm, lip balm, yeah. And so, yeah, it is what it is. <laughs> okay, and next we have a teeny tiny, Tula, and I have a lot of Tula products, and they have so many, and it's a clean beauty, but what is this? This is Revive and Rewind Revitalizing Eye Cream, and it is probiotic and superfoods, okay. And let's see, it's clean beauty, clean and effective. It says this eye cream hydrates conditions and helps minimize the appearance of fine lines around the delicate eye area. Use AM and PM. I'll give it a try. I usually don't use eye cream in the AM only because I use waterproof mascara and you know you need oils or something um, like that to get the get it off and so what happens is when I use um, eye cream and they tend to be a little bit oily or tend to have a, a little bit of texture to it you know my eyelashes touch throughout the day and I have little dot of black eyes by the time I get home so I'm always looking for that cream that's totally absorbed and I use the um, the ordinary um, the caffeine and that works fine because it's absolutely absorb with no oily residue but you know this is something for me to try in the p.m. and if I decide not to try it I'll throw it in as a small thing for the giveaway okay and I think this is the full size it is and this is by Ren and it's called clean skincare and it looks like everything I got today is clean skincare I like it I like that theme and this is a global protection day cream and it's clean to skin clean to planet and nour nourishes and combats skin discomfort and you know even though summer is coming and I mean it's winter really dries my skin out but summer does too and so I always like to have a nice moisturizer and usually I like to double my moisturizer with my sunscreen and that I use the um, Paula's Choice sunscreen with SPF 50 but I'm always looking for you know if I'm not going out and if I'm gonna be in a closed office or something I could use this really but um, let's see oh this is very nice it is full size here it is and but and I'll see because I do already have a moisturizer. If not, I'll add it to one of the future giveaways. And you guys know I have almost a thousand people, which is thousand wildflowers. And I'm so, so appreciative to you guys for that. And I haven't really been doing you guys justice. So yeah. And well, I digress again. So let me tell you about this Wren. 
It says and French and Italian and German. So where is it in English? Is it on the side? Let's see. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, a moisturizer formulated for sensitive skin to help combat skin com discomfort that can lead to visible premature aging. The formula replenishes the skin for renewed healthy glow. Results enriched with protection complex. It leaves the skin hydrated, replenished, and better protected against free radicals and environmental aggression. And for skin type, sensitive skin, delicate skin, skin affected by pollution, to use gently massage onto clean face and neck until well absorbed. Huh. Wow, okay. All right. Uh, let's see. Pre pre visible premature aging. Oh. I'm done past that. <laughs> so, okay. Well, let me think about it. Maybe there's somebody else out there that could use it more than I could because my skin is beyond premature aging. It's done aged. So anyway, yeah, that's that. So, okay. So what did I get today? I got the Ren Moisturizer Anti-Pollution Protectant. I got this, what I really want to try, Verso Deep Hydration Mask. And I got this... Tula Eye Cream and Kate Somerville Firming Serum. I definitely will try this and get back to you guys on it because I do like firming, you know, firming lotions and I usually like it coupled with something. And so I use the ordinary, the buffet. Oh my God, you put that thing on, you feel like your skin is and lift it up that's why i love it so much so yeah i know a couple of you have tried it and you said oh my god this is amazing so if you haven't tried it it's really cheap try it the ordinary yeah and my two samples here by skinceuticals and this is the intensifier hyaluronic acid and it's multi-function serum to help amplify skin's hyaluronic acid levels and so yep there's two packets of that and that's it we're not bad you know i'm not unhappy about it a lot of people may say oh it's skincare but yeah but you guys you guys skincare is so important get into a routine and you know i just i was just um talking with one of my friends and you know she asked me about that you know what should i get and what should i use i mean she's young she's beautiful and she has such beautiful skin and she's worried about it and i'm so happy that she is because you know what 30, 40 years from now, she's going to look just as beautiful. So yeah, get started if you're not already on the bandwagon of skincare, okay? Alrighty, my beautiful wildflowers. Thank you for being with me. I know this was a little short, but I will have some more uh, videos coming up. I don't know if I'm going to be able to upload this on Sunday or if it's going to have to go to Tuesday. So whenever I see you, I will see you, but I'll always be thinking of you. Hey, that was pretty good. That rhymed kind of, huh? Okay, alrighty, alright. Wake up, wake up, alright. Okay, my beautiful wildflowers, if I added any value, please hit like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, and there's the subscribe button, that's down there, but it looks like that. Please push it, ring the bell, and select all so you know every time I upload a brand new video. Alrighty, my beautiful wildflowers, I want you to have a good day, a good night, a good week, or a good weekend whenever you're watching this. And that does not matter. But what does matter, though, is in a field of roses, be a wildflower and never sweat the small stuff. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>this stuff and but you know i think i'm probably gonna go ahead and put it all to my um you know put it except for the kate somerville because i really want to try and get back to you guys but um i have so much skincare and um even though i love it and i want to try new things um some of the things are kind of duplicative 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 yeah i said that anyway so i'm gonna go ahead and um yeah probably put it in the no not probably i will be putting it in the um, giveaway so yeah and i hope you guys have been having a good week or a weekend, whatever, whatever day that I get this video edited and up, and I do apologize for that. And so, and I've been kind of busy over the weekend, just relaxing and taking care of my plants because spring is coming, put some outside and do all that kinds of fun stuff, right? And then um, now I'm trying to uh, video at least three videos before um, I leave today because um, today's Sunday and uh, my husband's gonna take me um, blouse shopping because 
I, you know, I realize I have so many pants, but then I have a bunch of sweaters, guys, winter clothes. I didn't realize I didn't have spring clothes, but duh, I haven't been out there working, so I had no need for it. And now that, you know, the spring is coming and it's getting cooler, I have to um, get some clothes that, you know, they don't look at me in the middle of summer going, dang, she looks hot. So yeah, I got to do that. So I'm probably going to go over to our mall today which my husband hates the malls but i mean but he'll take me shopping anyway so i gotta do that so anyway i want you guys to have a good week okay and i love you all and i miss you all and um i hope to see you soon okay all right be good be positive be happy and don't sweat the small stuff i'll see you soon <laughs>